Hello, my name is Sean Bowden, and I'm from Danfoss. And I'm going to introduce you to the Novacon. It's a digital actuator designed to operate the ABQM pressure independent balancing and control valve. This is a revolutionary product. It's going to change the way buildings are constructed. It adds value throughout a building's lifetime, from the construction phase, through operations and maintenance. It saves money for all the stakeholders involved. For the installer, it's less time, less work. For the systems integrator, it's easier and quicker to do their job. For the user, it's more data. And for the maintenance company, it makes their job a lot easier and a lot less work. It's actually four products in one. It's an actuator, a bus communication device, flow indicator, and data logger. In the back, there's a stepper motor with an encoder. So we get precise definition of the height of the valve cone, which equates to a precise flow control. Uh, but before I go into the details, I'd like to just recap a little bit about the ABQM. This is a pressure independent control valve. So system pressure changes do not affect the control flow. That's because any variation in pressure which is coming through here is balanced out on the opposite side by a membrane. A differential pressure controller opens and closes to ensure that the pressure across the control valve is constant. We have a linear uh, characteristic, so that means for every position of the control valve, we have an exact flow. This is essential for good control. Now the layout that we have here shows six Novacons on six ABQMs of varying sizes. We go from DN10 to DN32 with a single actuator. Now after installation, we need to commission the valve, which means the installer has to adjust the setting to the correct setting for the design flow of the terminal unit. It's difficult to see, it's difficult to reach, it's time consuming. The Novacon means that the installer doesn't need to do this. All these valve settings can be done remotely, thousands of valves in just a few minutes. The Novacon offers two types of control, bus only or digital, where the configuration and the flow control are determined by the centralized controller, and hybrid, where the configuration is, is via the bus again, but the actual control of the flow is determined by a local controller, giving an analog signal to the drive. Now to save time for the system's integrator, we have of course the prefabricated cables, but when those connections are made, an LED indicates that the connection is correct. We also have automatic addressing and board rate detection so that the bus can identify the actuators on the bus very quickly and easily, saving the integrator a lot of time. The LEDs also give us visual feedback of the status of the valve and whether it's opening or closing, and alarms in case of, for instance, a over temperature in the device or a um, obstacle trapped within the valve so it cannot close, or perhaps a wire breakage. Those alarms and status information are also transmitted across the bus so that the system integrator or the maintenance can identify the problem and resolve it. So for example, if, they, if the integrator decides or the maintenance crew decide that they need to flush the system to remove any particles trapped in the valves, then in normal cases they would need to remove the actuator, remove the maximum flow setting to open the valve fully, and then flush the system. Afterwards, they need to replace the setting that they had originally and put the actuator back on, and that for 2,000 valves or whatever size the building it is. And then, of course, that also in the ceiling. With an Overcon, it can all be done remotely. A simple uh, signal to all the actuators on a floor, for instance, to fully open and flush, it can be done with a few mouse clicks. Now, the Novacon also has a built-in data logger, which means that the alarms, status values, and flow rates are stored locally inside the actuator for a period of time, which means that later on, if there it's necessary to find, for instance, an intermittent fault, we can actually um, download that data file and make an analysis. Since the Novacon so precisely controls flow, if we take temperature sensors from either side of the terminal unit and feed them back to the building automation equipment, we can actually calculate the amount of energy used by the rooms. 
This allows us to do benchmarking across room to room, floor to floor, building to building. And this fulfills a trend that we see in the industry for getting more data out of the building. The Novacon was designed to connect the ABQM to building automation. So whether you're an installer, a systems integrator, or you're responsible for building maintenance, the Novacon will save you time and money. If you want to know more, contact your local Downforce representative or look us up on the internet under novacon.com.